Holly Willoughby and Philip Schofield's names were not on the list to see Queen Elizabeth II's coffin as press members, according to sources. The pair came under fire last week after being accused of jumping the queue to see the Queen lying in state. The presenters and ITV have since explained they held press accreditation as they were went to Westminster Hall for work. But now a source involved in the press list has claimed that Holly and Phil's names were not actually on the press accreditation list. They explained there had been some hoo-ha before the two broadcasters could be ushered into the press van. The source said, when they got there, their names weren't on the list so there were some discussions and, after some back and forth, Phil and Holly were given access and they were ushered through. The whole thing caused a bit of a hoo-ha, the insider added to the mail on Sunday. Separate sources claimed a woman in a wheelchair was ushered away while Holly and Phil dodged the queue. The family of a woman in a wheelchair claimed she was moved aside to make way for the pair as the pair arrived at Westminster Hall. Mia Fraga took to Twitter, in a now-deleted tweet, to describe the ill-edged situation that sparked national outrage. Sharing a picture of Phil and Holly, Mia wrote, this is a photo taken by my sister's husband yesterday after he had queued with my sister, their 10-year-old daughter and my disabled mum for 13 plus hours. My mum was ushered out of at Holly Wills and at Scofway so they could hashtag queue jumpers without even a thanks hashtag Scofield gate hashtag queue jumping. Holly defended herself and her co-star from the backlash as she addressed the accusations during a recent episode of This Morning. She said, the rules were that we would be quickly escorted around the edges to a platform at the back. In contrast, those paying respects walked along a carpeted area beside the coffin and were given time to pause. James Jordan blessed strictly as Neil Jones left partnerless in favor of foreign dancers, update, none of the broadcasters and journalists there took anyone's place in the queue and no one filed past the Queen. We of course respected those rules. Holly went on, however, we realize that it may have looked like something else, and therefore totally understand the reaction. Please know that we would never jump a queue. A night TV spokesperson also clarified that the TV stars were working as they explained the pair did not walk past the Queen's coffin. The spokesperson told Express. Co.uk, this morning had press accreditation and like other media, Philip and Holly were escorted to work from the press gallery by government staff. They did not file past the Queen's coffin. They were there alongside a host of other broadcasters and national press outlets for an item that will be broadcast on Tuesday's show. Any allegations of improper behavior are categorically untrue, 